Oh, you've got a big old range too, so why don't you just go right next to her? Come right here. Uh, where's our other charge lance? Uh, we've got... Wood. Why wood? You are so dumb. You are so dumb. Like, seriously. The goal is I want to kill some of these people so we can get out of here. What's up, my pylons? I'm Gamer, Gamer Pile, and welcome back to my RimWorld tutorial and playthrough. I got my handy dandy notebook. I've got a nice tall glass of something sweet to drink for my wetting of the whistle. And as you can see, hot dang, I got a lot of stuff here. We got some lavish meals, we got some simple meals, we got some gazelles, because that's what sometimes you need gazelles, you never know. Uh, and we have, uh, this is, okay. Hold on. <laughs> there is too much. Let me sum up. So, <laughs> golly, last time, we decided we were going to send a whole group of caravan arenas up to these pristine ruins right over here. It took about a day and a half to get there from our home over here in the blue dot. This, uh, this was something else. Um, we sent seven people, and we left four at home. We sent seven people. They're currently up here. And we're gonna bring them down here because when we got here, we saw all of our friends here, and they're gonna steal all our stuff. So we wanted it, wanted to take it quickly. So I unforbade all of the things. Um, these shells. Uh, I guess we gotta unforbade those too. Uh, the problem with those are they're actually in. Some of them are in deep water, so we're not gonna be able to get to that. Uh, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. A fermenting barrel. I've never even heard of that before. Cool. Uh, but like these, this mortar, we've got a whole buttload of, of mini turrets up here, which I'm excited about. There's just so much stuff here. Fire foam poppers, plain leather armchairs, the poor one. That's all right. Oh, a trade beacon I forgot to uh, re-enable. Um, the other thing we got to do is we got to claim all the doors. They my doors. They ain't your doors. I got to find that auto door and get all them too. Claim those. And the reason we're claiming them is so that we can go through them. If we don't claim them, we're going to get stuck. Oh, yeah, we had these batteries down here. I, there is that kitchen base. That would be nice to have. Um, yeah, we're going to uninstall that. That's what I had done. I'd forgotten. Um, so, yeah, we came here. But then there was a. we also noticed there's a bunch of raiders here. There's all these guys. There's all these guys. There's all these guys. There's all these guys. There are so many of these guys here. So this is going to shape up to be a heck of a day. I'm hoping that we can get these guys to draw the fire of these ones. We're going to sweep south. That's where we're going to go. I was thinking about going east. Um, oh, and I kind of... I see. I don't know. So there's one, two, three, four, five here. What do they got? Gun. Melee attacking. Because he doesn't have anything? He doesn't have any weapon. <laughs> a little under-equipped for this one here, there, dude. Uh, we've got an incendiary launcher. That's a problem. We've got a uh, uh, sh uh, a couple of uh, revolvers. And what are we armed with up here? Our friends. We have an assault rifle. That's good. An LMG. Heavy submachine gun. Uh, machine pistol. Heavy submachine gun and a pop shotgun. So they probably will do pretty well against them. I'm kind of thinking maybe we should swing over here. And I say that... How, what's going to be the best way to get in there, though? Uh, they're probably going to be drawn in... So I guess if we go here, it's going to take us forever to get there. This map is huge. Um, I, if we go here, that's probably going to be sufficient. Oh, there, I mean. Uh, and then we can hopefully try and... Oh, and the jade. Oh, look at all that jade. I want the jade. You know what? We're just going to go ahead and select it as mine. Maybe I'll remember to do it even. And, uh, oh, and there's all this plastic. I mean, there's so much crap here. It's incredible how much crap we have here. Let's do this. That's now ours. We've got a nice little stockpile here. We've got a stockpile here. I created all these stockpiles because I want to make sure that this stuff is considered our stuff. It will only be considered our stuff, I believe, if I remember correctly, if we have it in a stockpile. Oh, there's more package survival meals here. Hmm. Uh, okay, so... These guys are gonna get. These guys are absolutely gonna get mowed down by these ten or whatever that are here. These guys probably will too. My hope is these guys will swing north. 
these guys will swing east. And when we come in from uh, over here, we will be able to clear out these this crew. My hope is these ones are able to take out here. This one will probably help that because that's where they're closest to. That's the hope. And then hopefully that'll be enough. So that's that's going to be our uh, our plan for this. Let's go ahead and claim these doors. Make sure there's no more doors over here. There are more doors, but we got them all. Okay. Uh, let's claim that heater. Already done that. But the problem is we also were being raided. And you can see we've got Eagle and Ergo right here who are dying to get into our uh, fort. We've got, um, we've got, let's see, four who are left, but two of us are injured. Mongoose has a couple of bruises from a deer which had attacked him, so that's always fun. He had never, he had not had a chance to heal, and Hoyd's got a whole bunch of stab and crack wounds because he walked into a, a uh, wooden trap, because, you know, that's what you do. That's the situation, folks, and that's where we are at. So I am going to go ahead and watch here for a little bit. They're going to get through this door any second now. Outlanders. Oh, oh. Darn, they're going to try and steal stuff. That's not good. Well, okay, maybe we'll shoot each other. Oh, we got one. Oh, nice. Look at that. Shoot. Holy shnikes. Okay, how are we doing down here? They've made it through. Oh, no. They're just going to keep busting down doors until they get out of here. Come on. Outlanders from East Atuya are fleeing. Oh, good. So that's one. I'm going to go ahead and unmute, unforbid these guys' things here. Okay, so that actually went a lot better than I thought it was going to. Uh, these guys are having some trouble. These ones are going to are gonna die. This guy's going to die. This one already is dead. Oh, it was another Twi'lek. Poor Twi'lek. Uh, what do we got up here? Short bow. I don't think we're going to need a short bow. but uh, Well, at least they took one out before they went. There's a chance that Han might be able to do something. Uh, Beigia seems to be having a little bit of fun here. These guys are mixing it up over here. If we can get rid of them. All right, let's go back to here. See what we're doing. Can we please people from the Brixo Pact. Is that the good guys? Those are the, those are the good guys. Oh, no. Oh, this one's injured. Oh, no. Why are you attacking this one? That's mine. Oh, that's mine. She's attacking it. Uh, Zabrax are just have decided to steal what they can and leave. Darn it. I want the stuff. Come on. Okay, they're leaving. Let's go over here. Big Tuna. Big Tuna's down. Wow, this guy's got a shotgun. Oh, let's use that to our advantage. We got a charge lance over here. Let's go over here. Let's just make sure that's outside of the range. Oh, yeah, it is. Let's go. And, uh, oh, you've got a big old range, too. So why don't you just go right next to her? Come right here. Uh, where's our other charge lance? Uh, we've got wood. Why wood? You are so dumb. You are so dumb. Like, seriously. The goal is I want to kill some of these people so we can get out of here. Uh, okay. Oh, there's the other charge lance. So why don't we have you go right over here. And then Shiver can go up there. Super Freak can go here. Hopefully, well, let's actually back up just a hair. Blue's coming. The Twi'leks have decided to steal what they can and leave. They're going to take all the good stuff and I'm going to be so angry. I just want some of the Plasteel. I want some of the Neutroamine. I want the gold and silver. Um, cause then I can buy whatever I want. Um, there's a lot that I want. <laughs> Let's be frank. There's a lot that I want. Uh, what were these? Crypto sleep caskets. Oh. Has almost everything they need. I wish I could... I wish I could take these, but I can't. But I might be able to, t to disassemble them for the uranium and components. We'll see what happens. Um, let's clear out some of these bad guys first. Okay, let's come back over here. What are we doing here? Of course you are. Let's just go right here. They're taking down all my doors. It's flipping annoying. Okay. So that one... We've finished this. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. Then I am going to uh, assign to have a couple doors built. Uh, so we'll go to structure. I would like to have this just like kind of auto going. 
so that I don't have to sit here and do this all, uh, micromanage this account or this uh, group. <laughs> Easy for me to say. Okay, so now I can hopefully focus on these guys. Okay, so they're fleeing. Okay, so who's left? These guys down here are going to be left because they're jerks. So let's make our way down here. All right, good. Let's see what, what did they have that we could take. Oh, Psychite T. That's nice. We'll take that. Uh, a good pump shotgun. A uh, normal machine pistol works for me. A steel mace. Uh, it's poor, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, okay. And so far, we aren't hurt at all, I don't think. I could try and capture some of these people, but I just, I just don't want to deal with it. So let's go ahead and select everybody. They're coming down here. Oh, poor Beja. She's gonna she's gonna lose, man. Area revealed. Where was the area revealed? Whoa, oh my animals are all hanging out over here. Lovely. Let's claim those. Maybe there's beds and stuff in there. You never know. Um if I set my animals to just be in there, they actually will go in there and start exploring for me, just randomly by wandering. But I don't want to do that. All right, let's slow down. Um, who all's got what? Why aren't you using your revolver? Let's use that. And then... Oh, boy. Let's come back here. At least be behind something here. Okay. Another area revealed. Let's go check out what the animals are doing for me. Thank you, Dromedary. You're a very studious person. There's an empty room, but still. Okay. All right. I want to make sure. I want to try and get some of these guys here. They're all going to go after X Wing until X Wing is down. Once X Wing is down, I kind of want to. X Wing's a cool name. X Wing's are my, one of my favorite ships from Star Wars, too. Fast learner and kind. Crafting off the charts over here. Construction, melee. Oh, she should be getting right in there, is what I think. Uh. Come on down. Lavish meal deteriorated in storage. Yeah, so these are all... It is frozen, so that's good. But these are all um, uncovered right now. But because I created a storage unit for them, they're just gonna they're just gonna rot away. What are these? A fabrication bench. Oh, I, don't, I didn't think so. I was hoping I could disassemble it and bring it with us, but... Uh, tool cabinet. We don't have a tool cabinet. Don't have a machining table. We could take that with us, actually. Um, an awful bed. We don't want an awful bed, that's for sure. Okay. Let's try and get these guys to flee. Shoot him! Shoot him! Oh, super freak. Back that up, boy. Oh, because he's got a shotgun. Everybody else. Okay, now they're fleeing. Okay, so I think they should be. I'm going to just do that just in case I feel like taking any of that stuff. I think they should be. I should be able to just grab this stuff and go now. I'm going to try that because everybody is. Everybody is gone. Except for uh, some of these people. We got anything good over here? A normal pants, but 30%. Uh, good tribal wear. We might, we might consider that. Oh, a good synthread parka. Yeah, let's take that. All right, but those are less than fifty percent, and that's when they start to be quote unquote tattered. Oh, there's more though. Oh no, there's just X-wing never never went down. Man, she's a beast. She is uh, one hundred and seventy-one years old. Hot dang. She's very uh, efficient for her age. What is she doing? Oh, she's attacking. She's gonna take the guy out. She's gonna just like slaughter him here on the ground okay so let's try that i want to go to the world map i'm going to see if i can't reform caravan i can one and a half days and now we're just going to take all the stuff so i could capture people let's see who we've got well let's just see who we've got let's let's try that um okay i'm going to go through the bio for all three of these people i'm also going to take a little bit of drink while i do it so i'm not going to probably talk about it but check out on your camera and you can see yourself hmm that is a melee if I ever saw one. Can't firefight, 
can't do animals though. That's a shame. Was that that guy? Yeah. And let's try deer. Deer scout. <laughs> oh. Ooh, social. He would be a good thing to have in plants. Nice. And then a Zabrak. I like that there's a Zabrak. We've got, oh, a Masochist, though. But an Optimist and a Brawler, so they can't shoot at all. They won't be allowed to. Um, I don't think I really want want that one. This deer one is oh, greedy. Blah. But a Jogger. Jogger means he moves faster. And then what were the... Uh, yeah, that's right. Can't do it. Oh, and a chemical interest. So, even though 15 melee, I don't want anything to do with this. I definitely don't want anything to do with a pyromaniac. And a slow learner. What a pain in the butt that is. And he can't... There's even two things he is incapable of. If I were to take anybody, it would be Deer Scout. That's who it would be. Uh, let's go over here. Wow, look at all that. Holy crap. Well, I'm definitely going to take some package survival meals. I could take the medicine, Glitter World medicine. There's six of those. Dang. Got the smoke leaf joints. We're going to take all the herbal medicine because we can hopefully sell it. Maybe even on our way back. We've got so much stuff here we could probably do on our way back. Lavish meals we'll take. I don't know that I even want all this meat. I'm going to get rid of the meat for now just in case because I'm going to need... I have so much stuff I can bring with me. There's no sense. For now, we'll take these fine meals and these simple meals. But I may come back later and have them taken off. And then there's a bunch of hay. Uh, we can take the hay, and then if I need to, I'll, I'll take it back. I'm probably going to need to get rid of those. All right. Component, yes. Nutrient, yes. Chem fuel, probably. Wow, 1,200 chem fuel. That's that's a lot. Uh, we've got psychite tea, ambro smoke leaf joint, ambrosia. These are good things to sell. Steel, a bunch of steel. Jade! And that apparently is going to fill us up. So let us get rid of the steel for now, because plast steel is way more important than, than steel is. Even the uranium. Dang, that's a lot of uranium. Uh, we may go ahead and see a Resurrector Mech Serum. That is worth, like, so much. So that's going to be on our short list. I don't, uh, I don't think I'm going to need any of this stuff here. There's no point. I can build all this stuff myself later. Uh, I mean, I'd prefer not to, like the battery. I'd love to take the battery with me, but I, don't, I just don't think it's worthwhile. I forget what this does. Uh, glows under its light for a long time, then dies. So yeah, it's probably probably not a good decision to take that. Uh, refrigerators, stools, chairs, orbital trade beating, beacon. That might be nice to have. They're not that heavy either, which is good. Um, let's see, there's these batteries. Arg! I do. It's nice having extra batteries on hand. It's always nice having extra batteries on hand. It really is. Same with the heaters. Fire foam poppers. There's two of those in there, I know. Oh, deep drill. Ooh. Ooh. Let's take the deep drill. Hydroponics basin. I didn't even know you could take those with you. Uh, vitals monitor. That's going to be good for our hospital. I don't think I can build one of those yet. There's that. So we're going to end up coming back and having to, to get rid of a bunch of stuff. But like, I just, I'm taking these things because they are things I don't have. And they're things that I... Oh, it's like a steel hospital bed. It's, it's steel, which is what it is. It's not going to be as comfortable, but it will be more effective in the long run. Uh, oh, mini turrets. That's right. All these mini turrets. Forgot about that. Those are those are a non-negotiable. A sun lamp, that'd be nice to have, but we don't need it. We can build one ourselves. Um, it's going to take forever for these things to be loaded into, <laughs> uh, loaded into the caravan, but... There's another hospital bed. Butcher table. A multi-analyzer. This this helps out with a high-tech research bench. It helps make things go faster. But it's 60 kilograms, and I don't think that's something we're going to need. Uh, there's a couple more heaters. We're, we're over by a lot, but we can always figure that out, too, later on. Fire foam poppers. Large sculpture. Crematorium heater. A lot of these things we just don't need. Now, this is nice because there's two batteries that are much higher up. Um, so we might be going back. I think I'm going to drop the fueled stove. I It's it's what I brought here, so I feel like I should take it. But what wood fire generator is only one kilogram. That's got to be a mistake. So I'm going to pick that up. Uh, definitely. Okay, here's some more mini turrets. Fire foam popper, batteries. We'll go back and we'll get the batteries that aren't... Oh, one kilogram. 
That's got to be it. That's got to be a mistake. These hydroponics basins. Same thing. Uh, tool cabinet. Uh, that's 20 kilograms. We're just going to leave that. Um, this is worth 230. A legendary bed, though. Uh, why don't we... Oh, and some more deep drills. Well, this is a problem. <laughs> I'm greedy. Chem fuel power generators. Four of those we just, we just picked up. Uh, steel hospital bed, poor. I don't know about that one. A telescope. We don't have a telescope, actually. I do kind of want that telescope. There's the mortars. We want the mortars. The Megastream television. That is worth super duper amounts. And then all the chunks. And a bunch of dead bodies. Uh, but let's just go through the weapons here really quickly. See if there's anything really quick that we might like. I don't think... Th I think there may be one or two, but I don't think there's going to be a lot. Steel Gladius is actually... Uh, Actually pretty helpful. I mean, if I, I wish we could take more because there's so much that we could just go and sell. A couple of good revolvers. We'll take the good revolvers. Uh, a normal bolt-action rifle. We'll, we'll take that. A normal submachine gun and light machine gun. And a good pump shotgun. I think those are going to be... Well, I wish I took the t-shirt. There was that Synthread cultural garb. What's this? 38% though. Bah. Uh, there was a Synthread Parka. Wasn't it a Parka that we saw? So let, keep your eye out for that. Plain Leather Patch Leather. Mega Sloth. Doo -doo 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 -doo. So most of these are not any good. They're just poor or or, uh, or worse. <laughs> Synthread Parka. Good. Yeah, we definitely want that one. Look at that. 435 silver. That is definitely worth taking. Man. Okay, and then we've got... These are not below 50%, so they will not give the people bad moods. They're not great. Some... Oh, look at all this. Holy shnikes. 43,000 silver. That is incredible. That is just incredible. I wish we could take some of these with us. We don't have enough space. We're already almost double our mass. I do want this kitchen bot, though. Um... A hauler. Five! Oh boy. Yeah, that's our newest priority right there. That's our number one priority. It's an IED trap. We can't make that. Steel mortar, steel mini trap, or mini, um, mini turret. Thank you. Psychic emanator, another one. Soothing psychic field around itself. Oh, man. There's so much good stuff here. All right, so I'm going to have to put down all the batteries and heaters. I'm sorry, but we just, we have to do that. There's just... There's too much stuff here that we need or really desperately want, so it's not worth it to us. So let's go ahead and do that now. I almost want to put down the mega screen television. That's how much stuff we've got here. Uh, we need, we want the mortars. We, oh, I hate to put the telescope away, but we just can't take it. We just can't take it. Uh, the deep drills, and those are other, another one. That's just gonna be a pain. Uh, so small though, those things, okay. Let's find those batteries, because those are 20 kilograms each. Wow. Uh, yeah, so we'll do that. Hydroponics Basin, Butcher Table. Oh, we don't need to put the Butcher Table. Let's get rid of that. That was an easy one. Okay, that was a good one to, to put back. Heaters go away. Um, I guess, so that's a normal hospital bed. Let's let's see what we can do here before we get rid of that. I kind of do want that. That's an excellent school stool, but it's only three kilograms. I, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. Let's do... Oh, see, that. so this is the good hospital bed. Let's keep the good hospital bed and put the normal one back. And then uh, the vitals monitor we're going to keep. Hydroponics basin. It's only one kilogram. That's really not worth not taking. So we had the other deep drills that were better anyway, so we're going to keep those and get rid of that one. Fire foam poppers would be nice, but it's just a nice to have. It's not something that we need. Same with these heaters. And the battery here. That gets us within less than a thousand. We're less than a thousand away. We don't need two orbital trade beacons. Just one is going to be fine for what we're going to be using it for. It has a radius around it, which is kind of cool. So, like, you put all the things you want to trade within this radius. And then if you have a communications bench, you can communicate with passing ships. Um, okay. So, we didn't take any steel. Which is a shame. Um... What's this? Nutrition, number of days till it rots. 
Roger. We still have to get rid of 900. 900. So let's go ahead and get rid of these simple meals. Many of them are probably going to rot before we get there. That got rid of another 100. And this hay and kibble. Uh, that did a little bit, not a whole lot. We can get rid of the berries. Um, we don't need all this herbal medicine, but they're so light. I just don't, don't know. I don't know why we would, um, let's just see what happens if we get rid of all the herbal medicine. That didn't really do a whole lot. So for now, let's just keep it. We got to find bigger things to get rid of. The chem fuel, the chem fuel. Wait, what? Doesn't have any. Oh, because it's 50 grams, not 50 kilograms. Duh. Okay, so now we have to take another pass. I'm going to go through and take a minute because I feel like this is taking forever. Okay, so it looks like what we decided to do, or what I decided to do, was to keep all the uranium here and to take... Uh, and that's what that actually put us right under it because uh, before we had had all this here, that was, that was the problem. Um, I got rid of all the uranium... And uh, it gave us, it left us at 1,736 kilograms. And then I was trying to debate between taking the uranium or taking the steel. I mean, I could really go either way. Uh, uranium is going to be more important in the long haul, but steel is going to be more important in the short haul. Uh, see, and now I'm going back and forth. I was going to take the steel. I think I'm going to take the uranium, though. And we're going to make our way to uh, up the road to one of our friends and we're going to sell some of this stuff too um but hot dog we have so much stuff okay i think that's going to do it uh let's change the route real quick where are we going to go is this this is one of our friends yeah yeah so we're going to go here it's going to take a day and a half to get there but that's okay i honestly don't even mind because this is amazing and we're going to send it none of these sign colonists are able to reach 2x mini field thing uh-oh but I don't know which thing that is. Oh no. 2x mini field thing. All right, you're gonna have to, give, I'm sorry, you're gonna have to give me another second. I have to look up what that means. I'm gonna go to the wiki real quick. I've never encountered that before. I know it has some, probably has something to do with the fact that it is in the middle of the deep water and so they can't get to it, but I don't know which things it is. So maybe if I uh, go into Google, it'll tell me. Well, I think I finally figured it out. I have been at this for over an hour now. So I think the problem was the game recognizes that there are items here that are in deep water which cannot be accessed. So this deep water here, oh, are you kidding me? Oh, it's always something. We'll look at that in a minute. Let me continue to explain. So some of the things that I, that I was trying to take included like this mini turret here. There is a few more mini turrets up here. All these are in deep water and I can't access them. Uh, that's a pain. Oh, and this deep drill. Oh, that might have been one of them too. Uh, that's a pain. So it wasn't also, it didn't say mini field. It said mini fied. So these, this must be what minified means. Uh, quick research on the webs taught me that. And I was trying to load them into the caravan, but it couldn't because the, you know, they, they can't go into deep water. These, these colonists don't swim. So, uh, oh gosh. Yeah. There's a little fire there. It's going to spread all over the place. Gruel's going to have to put that out. So what I did was I had to take out all of the... I figured it was the mini turrets. That was like the biggest thing for me. <clears throat> so I put in all the things that are going to take a long time to load. Or would take a long time to load manually. Like the silver. Some of the other things that I really want to make sure that fits on there. Including like the... Uh, this IED trap and the, the kitchen base over here, the robots. Um, what Are they naked? Okay, good. I thought they were naked. I was going to be really upset. Incendiary launcher would be kind of neat to have, but that's okay. And uh, so I put them all on man or uh, automatically. And then what I did was I selected people to manually put all of these mini turrets on there because I really do want them. They're so valuable to me right now. I can't make them myself, 
Uh, and they take they do take steel to repair, and to, they, the barrel wears down. I mean, it's a whole thing we'll get into when we start using them. But they're a great base defense that keeps your colonists safe. So I really want them, especially so many, and they're so free, uh, which is the best price. So yeah, I uh, so they've been packing up. I finally got it to work. They've been packing up since then. I've explored. I found a couple other places. This one was pretty neat. I've already taken a, taken one of them away. But there was a this tech prof sub persona core. This will teach your researcher to finish whatever they're working on currently uh, for free, just like that. Boom. It can only be used once, but that's going to be awesome. We're going to take that and use it when we get back to base. I also found an actual uh, AI pers sub persona core, which is worth boatloads of money that we're going to take as well. We've already we were able to manually put the hauler bot in. That's a hauler five bot. I mean, of all the bots that you know you really need to have the higher tiers hauler is probably the least one at least in my opinion um and uh i do want these hydroponics basins that would be pretty awesome but i don't know that i'm going to be able to get all that in there uh and then there are these wood fire generators which for some reason still are labeled as one kilogram so we're just going to take it we're just going to accept that gift from whomever and go from go with it from there in addition over here we've got uh, our first uh, we got a nice little hard snowstorm coming on we are starting to rebuild. Uh, why aren't you building it though? Let's go ahead and construct that. And um, that'll be really nice once that's all done uh, because then hopefully the baddies won't be able to get back in. At least that's the hope. Um, why don't I have you just work on that door? That would be good for you. And that's that. Uh, I'm just gonna stay until Cruel can put out this fire. They've given up and are leaving. Okay, good to know. They're from a different place. Everybody's from somewhere. Every, everybody's from somewhere. Wow, that was uh, that was profound, gamer pile. That was that was amazing. Plain leather has rotted away in storage. Yeah, it's unroofed, and so these things are gonna go away. I'm not taking any of these anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, we could uninstall that though, because I think I want to take that with us. And that's that. So I tried like six ways from Sunday to try and get all this stuff in. Uh, I In the end, I've done this so many times, I don't really know what I've taken. I know that I, I was, did not get that stupid hospital bed. I don't know where the excellent hospital bed is. But if I can, if I could find that, I would definitely take that with us because that's going to be, that would be pretty awesome. Again, I don't, I don't know because it's reading these as existing for loading the caravan purposes, but it's not reading them as reachable, which is, you know, a problem. It's not labeling them to me as reachable. It's only labeling that in the game. So it says, you know, you can't take that. And I'm like, but why not? And uh, I don't even know which ones it are. I tried a whole bunch of process of elimination where I was untaking things and, and I just couldn't figure it out. And uh, yep, that's where I ended up. So there we are. All right. Well, we're going to try and finish loading up all these bad boys here into our caravan. And then we're going to try and make like a bandit and get out of here as fast as we can. If we don't, I have a feeling we're going to be attacked. We may even be attacked tomorrow. That would be a bummer. I don't want that to happen. Remember the last time that happened. Uh, so, But that's the goal. That's where we're shooting. So with that, I'm going to actually go ahead and say... Farewell. I've still got to record another episode tonight. It's after midnight now, and I'm still working here. Um, uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for thank you for being here. I really appreciate it. Uh, don't forget to use all this swag to hit that subscribe and like buttons, especially if you want to get more uh, informative content or commentary and general buffoonery, which is my specialty. Uh, ding that bell so you get alerts to all my future content and check out these videos because I think you're going to like them. Until next time, my pylons, stay safe and be well.